Hi there. Uh, welcome to an English lesson, another English lesson. We're going to get started uh, working on page 96. In this activity, we're going to listen. Uh, we're going to review body parts and descriptions. Okay, we're going to remember body parts and we're going to describe body parts. Uh, for this activity, we're going to do a listening, listening. we're going to practice listening skills and we're going to listen, okay, on track 59. On track 59, it says... Track 59. My friends. Okay, before we get, we continue, um, it says number the children. We're going to put the right number. Like for example, he has brown eyes. Who's the one who has brown eyes? Who's the one? Is this one? This one? This one? This one? Okay, let's listen and check the answers. He has brown eyes, her hair is blonde. She has green eyes, his legs are long. We're different, we're not the same. We all like to play this game. She has black hair and he is short. We're great friends. I like them all. Okay, easy. So listen again, pause the video and listen again. Vas a, vamos a pausar el video y a escuchar de nuevo para completar la actividad. Bien, aquí está la actividad resuelta una vez que hayamos eh, realizado las actividades. Eh, vamos a ver qué número corresponde a cada figura. Let's see. He has brown eyes. Number one. Okay, it's he. He has brown eyes. Number two. Her hair is blonde. Who's, who's got number two? Her hair is blonde. Okay, she's the one. She has green eyes, it's number three. She has green eyes. Yeah, his legs are long. It's number four. His legs are long. We're different, we're not the same. We all like to play this game. She has black hair. Who's the one who's, who has black hair, which is number five? Okay, this one, she has black hair. And he is short, short. He is short, which is number six. All right, check your answers and let's continue. All right, let's go to page number 97 and let's work on this activity. Find the difference and circle them. Vamos a observar estas dos figuras. Vamos a encontrar las diferencias. And what differences? For example, eh, recordemos usar preposiciones. ¿Cuáles son las preposiciones que hemos estudiado? In, on, under, behind, next to, in front of, etc. For example, in picture A and picture B. In picture A, let's see, in A, the rooster is behind the pineapple. The rooster is behind the pineapple. In B, it's in front of the pineapple, right? That's the difference. In picture A, the rooster is behind the pineapple. And in picture B, it's in front of the pineapple. What other difference can you come up with? Like the cow, look at this. In A, the cow is behind the sofa and in picture b the cow it's is next to the boy see 
Okay, the train in picture A is next to the boy and in B the train is under the sofa. Right? Okay, podemos hacer esa actividad y podemos decirlas en inglés en voz alta. <coughs> Para ir terminando esta explicación, completemos esta actividad. Dice, listen and label the, the children. La, who's Dan, who's Melanie, who's Ellen, and Tracy. So for this, we need to listen. So we're going to listen and, and co complete the activities. Entonces en español dice, escucha y etiqueta a los niños. ¿Quién es cada quien? Track 60. Track 60. This is Tracy. She's wearing a hat and a blouse. She's also wearing brown sandals. This is Alan. He's wearing a jacket, a scarf, and gray gloves. He's not wearing a cap. This is Dan. He's wearing a t-shirt, shorts, and sunglasses. This is Melanie. She's wearing jeans, boots, and gloves. She isn't wearing sunglasses. Okay. Let's listen. Listen again. Escuchemos otra vez. Según la descripción, ¿quién es cada quien? Mm, track 60. Let's listen again. Okay, we got the answers. Okay, this one is Alan, this is Tracy, this is Melanie, and this is Dan. Voy a escuchar la, el audio y comparen las respuestas. Okay, vamos a quedar ahí. Eh, nos vemos en la próxima lección. Bye, bye.